everyone welcome back to my channel today we are going to be taking a tour on my newly built cafe um this cafe is something that i have been working on for quite some time and uh, quite frankly it just took me a way too long to finish but i am finally done and i can finally show you guys what it looks like so Without further ado, I am going to get on with the tour. So, first and foremost, we have these beautiful trees, these street lamps, this crepe cart. So, you can get a sim to tend this cart. And they would take their food over here and they can eat. These tables are actually multi-functional. So, you can work here. And you can eat here as well. So I just love the fact that you can do that on these tables. So I thought it was a good choice to put outside. And uh, we have the entryway here. Let me just give you guys a quick glimpse of it. So this is what the entryway looks like. Um, there's a cute couch, a plant, and... Uh, just a magazine rack you can actually place something down on that if you like but i decided not to i thought it looked um very simplistic and it is an entryway so usually you know you wouldn't have too much clutter in there so that's the entry and now we walk in and we come into the cafe so we are met with this beautiful um counter here that again you can work so you can have three sims here now this table actually sits i think six sims but because i have it placed against the wall you can only sit three sims but that's fine i mean three sims is plenty so you can work there as you can see my sim is hard at work and uh, we have the actual um tables and chairs here again where you can chill you can actually have uh, four sims come sit at this table and work on a laptop i found that to be so cool because you can you know do like business meetings and all these different things i found that to be a really cool feature and yeah of course as you can see this sim she is having a cup of coffee so um this is again another multifunctional table so great for the cafe environment so we have more chairs more tables over here we have another combination again um and these beautiful posters i did place down i don't even know what this is i will call it the dent in the wall <laughs> Um, I can't remember exactly which update we got this with, but I thought it looked kind of cool. It looks like condiments, you know, so you can picture that you get something to eat and you have the condiments there. And that's what I picture that to be. So, um, we're going to pretend that's what it is. And over here, we make our way to the counter, which we are met with this beautiful sim and she is hard at work right now um trying to take care of the restaurant and all the you know orders so we have the counter here where you can see some pastries in the showcase you can see some cupcakes um bowl of fruit you know i just thought that i could put some things that i think would be in a cafe and of course i went ahead to add the showcase uh items again all around so it looks i think it looks pretty cool you know it looks as though they have they cook their things hot on the grill and then they put it in there so i i found that to be a cool feature again just placing items around that i thought would go well um with the cafe team again with the posters i love the cafe posters i think that they are so cute and a very great addition to the cafe over here we have some more food again and we have double ovens this time this is a great feature i think because now you can imagine all the pastries and everything is being baked in these ovens and that's when they are going to be placed into the showcase area over here so i thought again that is a great feature i did place down some of the 
breakfast um, trays. I don't think your sims can actually use this. I think it's meant to be used in bed. But that's fine. I think it looks cool. You know, it actually fits the cafe theme. So why not place a few down? So that's it for this area. And we are going to make our way into the hallway here. Which, before I tour that other room, let's get into the bathroom, which is over here. So this is the female bathroom. We have three uh toilets we have a sink we have a bin i think i placed a dryer in here let's see yes i did so we have a dryer over here and cute plant and if we go over on the next side we have the men's bathroom again we have some urinals a dryer and another sink with some plants so i thought you know they um the separation of the bathrooms uh, were pretty cool because in a real restaurant, you would have separated bathrooms. So I thought that would be a cool feature. So that is the bathrooms. And now we make our way into this section here, which um, I think is a pretty cool place to chill. You know, we have the... Um, the table here where you have some condiments and as well as you have a nice coffee machine so you can self-serve as well and there are some options over there on the table where coffees and you can imagine maybe um different things to add to your coffee to enhance it so i i love that how it fits in well there and the decor again i love how these lights look over this table i think it suits the theme and i love it i was trying to give off the loft vibe i would say um with these colors so i really really loved how this turned out as well as i think that in a real cafe you would have a lot of blacks you know i think a lot of cafes are black probably to replicate the color of coffee and browns and stuff like that so i think that you know these work we have a microwave over here we have another coffee well tea kettle again where you can make your own stuff um and over here we have another workstation again we have some chairs and a bookcase so again you can do some more work some research all that good stuff you have this beautiful painting i think it suits so well it fits so great in this space i think it just adds everything and it stands out so i really really love that and that's pretty much it for this room now we are going to make our way up to the top part of this build and which that leads us to again another workstation this time there's actually six tables sorry six seats but i don't think that it can actually fit them yeah because the plants are blocking but that's fine again a uh, tree seats is fine enough again we have this beautiful painting um showcase here we have uh, this cute bicycle um ha well the core i think we got from one of the loft updates we have this drinking machine which i found to be super super cool because you would find these things um from time to time as you go in various uh, restaurants or you know different places so I think that that was a cool idea to have um, again you have uh, some more workstations and you also have this selection of uh, I think it's supposed to be books I can't remember right now what it is exactly but we are going to imagine that it's magazines and you can choose you know from a wide variety of magazines to read while you're up here so that's that and as you can see um i did place down again another one of these i thought it would be kind of cool because you know when you walk up the stairs it's in basically the middle of this area and anyone who wants again coffee or whatever they can again come over there and do what they please and to complement that you have another tea maker so if you do wish to get some coffee up here as well and you don't want to go downstairs you can come over here and make your coffee and i think that is really cool 
over here we have a nice seating area um i love the colors again this color scheme is just beautiful i think um i love how the rugs just blended in so well and it's so abstract but it looks so so pretty i did try a few rugs before but i think that this one turned out the best so i really love how that space looks the plant i think again suits the area well we have a lamp over there and that's just beautiful so i did want to showcase this little uh, mezzanine area here with this beautiful beautiful light i have been seeing these lights being used over so much bills um even when we get the new houses in the game i see it all the time and i'm like i can't use it because it's so long so if you place this on the well, first floor it will basically touch the ground and it just doesn't make sense but it's so so pretty so i figured because this is a loft space it would work well and i think that it turned out so pretty because it's so beautiful and i finally finally got to use it so i am really really happy about that and i think it looks great so we are gonna make our way over to this area here which is another seating area except we have a television over here so again um you can just chill out and you can work you could do whatever you want and you can also enjoy some tv so that's a plus and uh, this door here actually leads out to a small balcony outside and again with the posters i think that it suits the vibe in here we have another table and chair this um item here i think is a cheese tasting uh item i think that it's cool because you can imagine that this is something else because you actually see them like feeding each other so i think that it's super super cool because um again it's food and you can pretend that they are not eating cheese and something much more delicious you know so i love that and i thought it was a great addition to this tiny balcony over here we have a i am not exactly sure what i wanted this space to be but I did turn it into a mini office. Um, I tried a lot of things in here actually, but I finally made it into a mini office. So you can imagine the um, the manager of this cafe would come up here and they would have a lot of paperwork to do and all that good stuff. They have a fan and a plant, beautiful piece of art. Over here, we do have some amenities. So we have a microwave, we have a coffee machine, and we have some stuff on here that looks like honey and different things that you would probably put in coffee. And maybe you can grab a bite to eat, maybe. Underneath the um, these items, we have a mini fridge. Which again, you can imagine there are drinks in there and maybe some food. So the manager can actually warm up the food in the microwave. So I found that to be cool. And on these other shelves, I think this was with the market update. Um, you can see food items there. So she is pretty much um, taken care of in this tiny, tiny space. Over here, we have a little... Um, what would you call that there's hangers and looks like a uniform so i would say that when she comes into work um she could probably change her clothes and uh get into her work outfit um whatever she may have to do in the, the office you know i i think that that was a cool addition and i think that the space is really cute so this is pretty much it let me just show you guys the view of the loft so we have this beautiful area here and then we have the beautiful view where you can see the downstairs area and i really really love that 
and i did use these lights again over here so I, again i did find a way to use it and i found that it turned out really really nice i do think that these lights are just absolutely gorgeous just look at the detailing i love it and it suits it so this is basically um the tour of the restaurant and uh, that is pretty much what this is i really love how this build turned out i love how the outdoors turned out i love how everything turned out honestly it just is really beautiful and yeah i think it's pretty realistic to what an actual cafe would look like the only thing that i probably should have changed is maybe the um the surrounding areas you know it looks like the cafe is in the middle of nowhere <laughs> so there's that but i mean um it's still pretty much realistic i love how it turned out and yeah oh i just wanted to showcase these windows so these windows actually did come with the loft update and um they worked really well for the cafe as well as i was trying to find something that would scream sign you know usually when you go to these places they have like nice big signs up and this is actually a painting that I placed there, but it to me it looks like a sign or could be some sort of symbol that represents what the cafe is. So I thought it would have been a great addition to place that on top and I think that it really, really turned out nicely. So that is my cafe and I will be including some screenshots of the different areas in the cafe for you guys to see a better look of what the areas look like and yeah so do enjoy the screenshots and i will see you guys in the next one have a good one guys bye <music>